Disappointed. Oh, Martin, you want to hear it? Go ahead, Martin. Because he hit someone. Yeah. Right? Yeah. Exactly. Did he take down building to be someone? No. Instead of taking accountability for hitting someone, this is from Ben Dojo, instead of taking accountability for hitting someone, what did he say instead, Matthew? Uh. I lost my head. I think I lost my head. It wasn't my fault. Yeah, it wasn't my fault. So I had these two sentences. What do you say? Yeah, I I lost my head. It wasn't my fault. He walked in front of the car. Right? So he said, instead of taking accountability, he said it wasn't his fault. He said he walked in front of me. And when did you drive? Any of your life, is it uh, ever the pedestrian fault? No, no, no right? It's yeah. your fault. You're driving the car, pedestrians have to ride away. If you hit them, it's your fault. I know, I know. I, I can say it, but you're crossing the street, and like, let's say you're driving, and you don't know that that's the right in front, and you hit them. It's considered a pedestrian because it's not a so crosswalk. very generic because, of course, if someone ran out in front of your car and drove away. We have to go historically in this situation from the way that Jamie would be killing them. His brother is constantly asking him to bail out. Do you think he has had as much, or Jamie has a lot of respect for his brother's version of the story at this point, or do you think he's kind of like this dude? Still not taking accountability for his actions, right? Still, and, and I think I think I fully agree with you on that. Like when I said it, I gave a very blanket statement just for people that aren't driving that. Please pay attention so you don't hit somebody if he does. It. But also, uh, yeah, something ran out of front of whatever. Yeah, definitely. But given the Ted's history and how many problems he's had with the law and been in trouble and so forth, Jamie seems very just. So 